all Chicago way. He had a bookie style that no one else could play. He was a top man at his craft. But then his number came up and he was gone with the draft. He's in the army now, a blowing reveille. He's the boogie woogie bugle boy. Reverend the- gentlemen, you're the best of my regiment. I picked you to go on a secret mission. We're gonna have a line come in. To tell us what the mission is. You will ask him no questions because you have read the pamphlet. Good day to you, Captain Winters. Hey, Bernyaks. I'm going to give you a classified briefing here. Try to stay awake if possible. My man is professional. Hmm. We'll see. You, what's your name? What's up, you, Limey? What are you asking me for? Just share your knowledge. Cut the lights and play the film. This is what we know so far. An SS unit in Norway come across this. Got artifacts in it from all over the world. Well, usually it wouldn't mean much, but they found something. Initially, they didn't know what they found, but they found a lot of it. They must offer their team, and even then it was very accessible, and they have barrels and barrels and barrels of the stuff. We still don't know the exact location. Our best agents are on the case. But we do know they're sending lots and lots of troops to Norway, and there's a firefight going on. And our comrade, the Russians, are about to send a team in. This is quite interesting, chaps. They've got their best scientists together. And this one in the suit, we've been watching them a long time. We've found out there's at least 30 different names in 30 different countries. And these moldy fellows, they pulled them out the ice, and they're still moving. And you see here, they gave volunteers of their own men. I do hope you yanks don't have a weak stomach. This next bit's quite disturbing. We think this is stuff from the barrels they found in Norway. We assumed it was just some kind of liquid that was pouring in. Then this happened. It's definitely showing some kind of intelligence. And if that wasn't bad enough, look what they did to the Bosch. And then they torched the old chap. We assumed to get rid of their experiment. But no, that wasn't the case at all. They're just saying what injures the old fellow. All it did is just burnt his skin. On our agent said they cut him in two, there was no injury at all. We put it in there. Big good fellow, pop the lights back on. So then, chaps, anyone got any questions? Jolly good. Get them arms down. Thank you for that briefing, you can get going now. Well then, good luck. Toodle pip. That smoke liney son of a... Toodle Get your gear on. See you on the plane. <laughs> Just going on my break, you know. Sorry. You're still in shot. Oh, what's my line again? It's to Oh, yeah. Geronimo! This is Channel 7 News. I'm here with two stars from the series WWZ. What's it like filming here? It's crazy as work in it. Ever know what's gonna happen here? Where is the bathroom? Go on, have a beer. Would you like a mint because you need it? I'm now in Studio 2. We cast members from a future series. The highest that goes terribly wrong. We're the dead. But you can choose what it is called. Yeah, bruv. Yeah, if you've got an idea, just leave it in suggestion. If you've got any good zombie ideas, I might have to make them. I don't mind, Captain. That's all I'm here for, you know. Doodle pip.